So we're going to look at scissors. Uh, and for the beginner, there can be uh, often a bewildering uh, a range of scissors uh, available for bonsai. Uh, each of them has their own specific purpose. We'll look at those. <coughs> uh, big handled uh, scissors like this with some very thick, heavy blades. These are uh, ideal for, for, for root pruning. So when, when you're repotting, when you have the tree out and you need to just cut the roots, these, this is, these are ideal. So these are, I these are really for, uh, for root pruning. You can prune tops of trees quite roughly with these, but the way, the way in which the, the hand is, you can't get too, uh, too much detail work uh, through these. Um, <coughs> moving on to, to these, which are uh, ideal for cutting uh, pencil thick or finger thickness branches. And these will cut through uh, a branch that thick. You have to put a bit of effort in, but if you uh, if you cut right at the base of the uh, uh, of the scissors, you can get you can get through a fairly thick branch quite easily. Um, you can see through the thick, thickness of the blade there, you've got a lot of power. Uh, the bent arms there will give you uh, extra leverage, uh, and these are quite a sturdy pair of scissors. Uh, the downside to them is though that they're very uh, clumsy to use. Uh, when, when trying to do detailed fine work. So when you're trying to do uh, that kind of fine work then we need to use a much finer pair of scissors. Uh, so you can see here these are much lighter, uh, the arms are, are much thinner and, and the blades there are very very fine. Uh, and these are the kind of scissors that you need to use uh, when pruning uh, thinner branches, uh, getting inside the tree uh, and for doing detailed work like uh, candle cutting on pines. This, this is a very good uh, all-round pair of scissors. Uh, you have enough uh, strength there to cut through pencil thick branches uh, and enough um, delicacy uh, to, cut, to do uh, a lot of fine work, particularly with the tips there. So with the tips you can get in and do fine work and then with the, uh, the blades closer into the, uh, to the pivot point there you can cut through thick 